What's going on, YouTube? Um, figured I was going to do one of these other shave ones again. Shave radios and sports stuff. Um, nobody said anything bad about the last time I did one. I've got some other sports stuff I want to get on. This is one of those things get busy. I figure I got to shave anyway. Might as well just do one of these. I got something kind of interesting to talk about anyway. Um, so a little, little bit different of a soap. It's a more baseball one. Um, it actually kind of smells like you know, spring training type stuff, beer, fresh cut grass, peanuts, stuff like that. Um, and a little bit of a, little bit of a hard type soap. So I got to get it on the brush. But anyway, so, um, it's Friday, um, October, what's today, 19? No, yeah, 18. Um. So there's a football game on last night, Thursday Night Football. Um, kind of a boring game. The only reason why I kind of paid a little bit of attention to it last night is because it's a uh, Chiefs and Broncos game. Um, so the team I follow in football is actually the Raiders. So I was kind of paying attention to it last night just because it was a you know, divisional game. And uh, didn't watch the whole thing beginning to end. But the reason why I ended up uh, wanted to talk about the game is because Kansas City starting quarterback and I'm getting hurt, Patrick Mahomes. So they were trying to go for a first down last night. And he ended up getting hurt. So NFL's been trying to do a lot of um, rules and and new penalties and all that stuff like that to protect the quarterback, and you know, rightfully so. But some of the stuff is you know pushing it a little bit. So I guess Mahomes end up getting the dislocated um, knee, I think. So he's going to be out a minimum of uh, three weeks now. So we'll see what happens with that. You know how sometimes these teams are really secretive about how hurt some of the players are. So We'll see what happens. You know, hopefully it's nothing serious. As, as much as I don't like the Chiefs and and I don't really carry the way about their the quarterback, Raiders could have taken him. Any other team could have taken him, but um, Kansas City's got him. A good young player. He's got a kind of an arm on him. Makes the league better. But another player that, for the Raiders, he ended up getting suspended for the year because of he's got a history of. Hitting people in the head, helmet to helmet contacts. Um, so, is there a bias in the league of protecting the quarterback? I mean, not that they shouldn't be. I think all players should be protected. So, is this on the coach or getting the kid hurt? Um, is it one of those things that, uh, you know, they. Chiefs are going for a first down, and why not just give the ball to one of their running backs? Not that running backs shouldn't get protected either, but is there a bias against you know, certain players, quarterbacks especially? Is it fair to the rest of the, the, the players on the team to, you know, overly, overly protect one player? Quarterbacks included. Um, I mean, there's certain other players on the team, like running about the offensive side of the, the football, that these quarterbacks get overly protected. And is it, you know, some another friend of mine was saying it's, it's no fun league now that, that there's all these rules and regulations. And granted, we need to protect the players because somebody like Mahomes with the, the arm. He's got makes the league fun, but not that it was 
Mahomes fought that he didn't get hurt. So, but he still got hurt. So he's going to be out, like I said, a few weeks. So this is the aftershave. It really does kind of smell like, uh, you know, like good stuff. Spring training, baseball stuff. So I was going to mention use this one last time. I was in a hurry. So on that continuation, on that um, subject, I was watching the Raiders versus Patriots game, you know, three weeks ago. And uh, Raiders quarterback Dirk Carr, and I'm getting hit. They didn't throw a penalty on that. Even the commentators were saying if that was Tom Brady, the league would have thrown a penalty flag on that hit. So, um, you know, same time, let him play, but you got to protect the quarterback. But when you when you draw the line. So that's, that's what I wanted to kind of get on camera and talk about today. I've, I've picked some other stuff up. Um, it's more uh, Dodger stuff. So since the Dodgers are, are out of the playoffs now, I'm still kind of upset about that. I don't really want to get that stuff on camera. So eventually, one of these days, I'm getting those on camera. But that's that's my question to anybody watching this. Is, um, is the NFL protecting too many players more than they should more than others so I, I think i think yes but that's just my opinion so anyway let me know what you guys think have a good one